सो हे एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू पार्ट थ्री ऑफ क्रिएटिंग फूड और रेस्टोरेंट वेबसाइट यूजिंग जस्ट एस टी एम एंड सी एस एस सो या वी हैव वी आर कमिंग ऑन पार्ट थ्री एंड वी हैव टू कम्प्लीट दिस होल वेबसाइट इन द फर्स्ट पार्ट वी हैव कवर्ड द नेब बार एंड द हीरो सेक्शन एंड इन द सेकेंड पार्ट वी हैव कवर्ड हाउ टू क्रिएट दिस ब्राउजर मेन्यू एंड द अबाउट सेक्शन and in the third part we we are going to cover how to create this um, services section as well as this order section and this customer review section as well so we will cover these three topics in today's video let me show you so this section is uh, approximately same as this section so we just use the same uh, classes okay and for this we have to design it and uh, in the below here we have to design this section as well okay and in the last section we will cover how to create this blog design and the footer okay and uh, yeah so let's start the video let me just show you the responsiveness so when i go to inspect here you can see when i check the responsiveness you can see it's look fine okay and yeah it looks amazing here you can see so yeah we will cover these three topics today so And without wasting our time let's start the video first create a comment and add services section and then let's start the services part so here first create a uh, container and add the so first create a div and add add a class name services then inside the services add a container inside that container add a section title which i will use this one we also for okay then we will add section subtitle that will be same as the before this one so let me just copy this one this line and paste it here okay now after that what we will do is to add the services grid okay so create another services grid and let me when i save you can see we have already styling because we have already created so inside the services grid what we will do is to add the service card okay and hit enter inside the service card we will we have to add three things that is icon heading and paragraph so start with the icon here add the class name and that is fs f a utensils okay click enter and you can see we have now now add the heading that is catering okay you can change according to yourself and then add the paragraph which is same as before now what i will do is to copy these lines okay and use four cards then just change the values like for the second one i will use uh, birthday cake okay so i will type birthday cake and instead of catering i will use uh, birthday party okay when i say you can see we have another cake and a birthday party now for the third one i will use users okay users and here inside instead of catering i will use wedding party then for the fourth one i will use glass cheers and instead of catering we will use custom party so custom party now hit enter you can see we have the same as before now what we have to do is to style this so these four things the same as the menu section so what we will do we have already styled the menu sections so come here and change, add the values for menu we will have to same as service okay hit enter and you can see these designs now for the menu category instead of menu categories we want services grid let me confirm from here it's um 
here you can see services grid services grid yeah now you can see those are in the grid okay for now after that we will go for here instead menu we have to add service card now click save okay now you can see we have some now we have to add the hover effect so we will add dot service card hover hit enter and you can see we can we have added the hover effect as well now here style the i as well so service card i hit enter and you can see uh, i think there is some error sorry so let's fix this okay so because of internet connection these icons are not showing so let's make it uh, responsive as well we have yeah here it is so in the menu categories we have to add services great okay, hit enter now you can see these as well and check for menu again and here for another one so just copy add services grid as well so now it look like same and these responsive as well okay so our services part is done and now let's move to the other one now let's add the delivery section so here just type delivery section and from here create a section with class name delivery and inside the delivery section add a container okay inside the container add a delivery container okay i know you think it's very easy but yeah it takes time to think about the changes and everything okay so keep supporting so here we have to add delivery image and inside it we have to add three images so first one will be image main which ones this one will be big so image src will be delivery one okay then here add another diff that is image secondary okay inside it add the image as well so i will add image 2 and just copy this one that is image 3 now hit enter and you can see it's here it is so we have three images okay now let's go for the content so come here and add create another div that is delivery content inside the delivery content add the these okay just remove this div and this one as well okay because we have to create the same one and just change the text of adding so just select this and remove with enjoy your food in your comfort zone okay i will not make changes on these two just remove this one okay because it makes the text too much okay i will just remove this one and for the button i will change it to here i will change it to order now okay so now hit enter and you can see we already started the button as well okay so these are three and images as well okay so now it's time to style it so come to style your css here let's come here and create the uh, comment that is delivery section okay now here let's style the delivery so first create a delivery padding and margin okay as you can see here okay so i forget to add the grid part here so in uh, inside the delivery image add a grid uh, image grid okay and these images will be inside the image grid okay let me just move it inside it okay select these three and put it inside here okay now it's fine so after the delivery styling add the delivery container 
so let me add delivery container and this will be same as display flex okay not display grid and a grid will be uh, one fr and one fr okay remove this one hit save and you can see they are now side by side gap will be same as 30 pixel but increase it to 50 and text align will be center sorry align item hit enter then after the delivery container let's add the delivery image inside the delivery image add the background color to transparent and height will be 500 pixels with border radius will be 10 pixels and uh, overflow will be hidden okay hit enter and you can see we have these things now after that we have to add the install the image grid so okay. the image grid display grid display grid and grid template columns with uh, one frame and one frame then grid template rows that is same as one frame and one frame there will be 10 pixels and height will be 100% and width will be same as 100% hit, hit enter and you can see here these are approximately aligned now we have to align it so here inside the image grid and image that is width will be 100% and height will be same as 100 object fit will be cover and body border radius will be 8 pixels then inside uh, the image grid we have to style the image main okay main image so that will be grid column will be one and grid row will be one divide span two okay and background color will be uh, this d and uh, border radius will be grid axis so now you can see it's perfect then move to the uh, second one that is image secondary here add the background same as d and border radius 8 pixels now let's style the now let's style the first uh, secondary image okay so here create another one that is image and select the first one that is nth child first first that is nth child second and grid column will be two grid row will be one now for the second one we will use grid column two grid grid column two grid row two hit enter and you can see they are aligned now we have to make it style okay so let's style this for the here you can see we have inside the delivery container instead of repeat we have to remove the repeat part okay that's why it's not aligned perfectly now it's perfectly aligned okay so now we have to go and uh, make it responsive as well for that what we have to do is to come here so come here and in the about container add the delivery container okay as well enter and you can see when i would when the width is less than 768 pixels it is responsive as well so it's look fine okay so our delivery container is also responsive and looks awesome so now it's time to style the another one okay so let's come to html file and now let's cover the testimonial part okay so first uh, create a comment that is testimonial section inside here create a section testimonials and inside this class create a container same as before create a section title that is what our customer sees inside that create a paragraph that is 
in the era of technology same as before okay hit enter and you can see we have two a section title and a section description here inside that create a testimonial grid inside the grid create a testimonial card and inside the card add the paragraph and a heading okay hit enter and you can see we have now create other two as well and hit enter now we have three cards now let's move to style.css and style these testimonial cards so here create a comment that is testimonial and start the styling so first add the testimonial okay and inside it add padding 100 and wear white okay now hit enter and then move to testimonial container but before that let's move to testimonials grid okay because we have already created a container i styled it before so that will be display grid and gap will be 30 pixels and at the margin top will be 30 pixels hit enter and you can see we have three cards now let's move to other one that is testimonial card so we have testimonials card and here what we will do is to add the background color then add the padding to 30 pixel from all sides then text align will be not center it will be by default then add the border radius to 10 pixel and transition will be 0.3 is hit enter and you can see it looks fine now now add the hover effect to the card so i will add testimonial card hover and that will be same as this one okay so when i hover you can see uh, let me show you okay so we have made some mistake here that is uh, testimonial card okay let me just confirm here okay so here we have added s but it's just testimonial okay that's why the effect not working so now come here and when i hover you can see this hover effect okay so after that here after adding hover effect so everything done from here now let's move and make it responsive so let's go here and here with the services grid add the testimonial grid as well hit enter and you can see when i lower the width you can see here it's responsive now uh, when i lower the width to five so now you can see it's look fine but we have to add here as well so let's come here and add testimonial grid and add to 2fr hit enter and you can see we have now this effect which looks better than before one okay now it looks fine and responsive as well okay so here i think i have forgot to uh, style this one okay so let's come back and here in the delivery content we have s2 p and a so let's go back and style with the about a section so here just add dot delivery content h2 and here add dot delivery content p and go back now it's look fine okay so yeah that's look fine now so if you guys just worried about these things i i am me too okay so yeah and also don't forget to join our playlist i'll provide the link in the description okay to like the video share the video as well and subscribe our channel and keep supporting guys because i will i need your support and if you support i will make videos i will make this type of videos in the future as well so keep supporting guys and so guys uh, this is now for this video and this video is already too much bigger so see you in the next video and let me know in the comment section how you like and please give us rating or the design and everything. So see you in the next video.